Hi, my name is Nikita, and today I'm going to show you how to integrate Visual Composer plugin into a WordPress theme. If you are a theme developer, you probably already know that there are many benefits of including plugins in your theme. First, it makes the development of your theme faster and easier, gives something extra to the users of your theme, as well as a familiar drag and drop interface. And by the way, integrating Visual Composer is free. So these are just to name a few. Luckily for all of us, including Visual Composer in your theme is really fast and simple. To do that, we'll use TGM plugin activation, which is a PHP library that allows you to easily require and recommend plugins for your WordPress themes and plugins. We're using TGM plugin activation because it's the most simple and basic way of integrating plugins. In this video, we'll go through the easiest way of adding Visual Composer to a theme. I'll use the 2020 theme as an example. First, go to TGM plugin activation website download section. Over here, fill out the form with all the required fields, select all the necessary checkboxes and click uh, generate. This will download a zip file with uh, all the uh, necessary uh, function prefixes and text domains. Next, we're going to extract uh, the zip file and inside this folder, we need to copy class TGM plugin activation.php file. So we copy that, then we head over to our WordPress uh, installation folder and inside it, uh, we need to select uh, our theme, in this case it's 2020, and we're going to paste this file inside our theme folder. Next, we head over to the zip file, and inside here we have this example.php file, so we open it. And we need to copy all of the contents of this file. So we copy that, we head back to our theme folder, and we need to open our theme functions.php file. So we open that. And at the very end of the file, we need to paste what we have just copied. So once this is done, uh, a few adjustments needs to be made. First, uh, this require once, we need to change the path since we copied it straight to our uh, theme folder, we can remove this part, hit save, and also we need to change this uh, plugins variable value. So what we can do is to head over to our Visual Composer help center and you can just copy and paste uh, the value of this plugins variable. So let's just replace it like so, hit save, and that's it. Now the user will be able to install Visual Composer straight from the notice by clicking on Begin Installing Plugin. Then click on Begin Activating Plugin and then Activate. If a user deactivates the plugin, he'll see the notice again. Now, once a person installs your theme, he'll see this notice and will be able to install the plugin straight away by clicking on Begin Installing Plugin. Then click on Begin Activating Plugin and Activate. If the user dismisses the notice at the start, then he'll still be able to see the message in Appearance, Install Plugin section. If the user deactivates Visual Composer, he'll see the notice again. Need further help in this process? Join our official Slack channel at slack.visualcomposer.com or contact us directly. Thank you, that's it for today and bye!